<laughs> and welcome to the format with your boy Matt Jackson, aka John Freak Killer, and we are coming at you with a SmackDown review, and I'm just gonna be talking about it and um, stuff like that because I've already did the rest of the week, so I might as well, you know, do the end of the week and continue to do this and try to catch weeks that are good, but. I have a special person on this show today for the format, and I have with me Mr. Joe Cool. This your boy, Joe Cool, here for a little while, on the format, and we are going to be talking about Smackdown from tonight. Today's date is... January 14th, well, it was January 13th for SmackDown, but it's January 14th, Saturday, 1 o'clock. Is this a commercial break right here in the middle of the match? Mm Mm-hmm. Okay. First match on is Braun Strowman versus Gunther for the Intercontinental Championship, and I just think this is going to be an amazing matchup, and hopefully either Braun can get the belt or... Not. Doesn't really matter. But we will see at least what's going to happen and what's next. Yes. So we got Braun versus Gunther. Gunther. For the Intercontinental Championship, I don't like the style of the title. We were talking about that earlier. Yeah. I, don't, I don't like the new I title. It's okay. Because I'm getting used to it. I like the old title. I like the white and gold. Like... And J.B. War was talking about. Yeah, Gunther's a great champion. Uh, but Braun, I don't think, he's ever won the belt. So, I don't think that. they're going to change the title on a on a regular Mm-mm. show. Not right now. No, not at all. But they could build a match. Yeah, they could. For Rumble or WrestleMania. True that. But, like... First day WrestleMania, not second day. Second day is main event. First day WrestleMania. Yeah. So for them to start this show off tonight is just, with that match, it's pretty crazy. Yeah. You know, a title match. Yeah. Starting off SmackDown. That was crazy. So, I don't know. Um, hopefully it's a good match. Um, so, so far it seemed kind of slow. I know Braun did the choo-choo yeah. around the ring. We had recorded our uh, Royal Rumble predictions tonight, and we had gotten those out of the way, and um, and we'll probably be adding to it if anything comes up to it. But so to come out probably the next weekend or something like that. But we are um, we'll be back with you shortly after the messages. So we're still on a um, Gunther and Braun Strowman match. It's going really in the good. Last segment. I it's mean, going it pretty was good. good match, Matches. Why is this wrestling? So they're wrestling good. Uh, some <laughs> some takedowns. I don't some, think any big things happened. Not yet. Nothing big happened yet. But I mean, two weeks yeah. ago they threw Braun through the wall. Yeah, throwing Braun through a wall recently. And stuff like that. But anyway, so this match is going good right now. I would, you know, I'm, I've got high hopes for this match. Because it's Braun Strowman. And it's not Braun Breaker. <laughs> Why do you hate Braun Breaker? I don't. He's good. The dog face gremlin. Yeah, but he needs to lose that belt. To Grayson Waller. Anyway. Well, I only have Grayson Waller come back at the at the Royal, Royal Rumble. Rumble, yeah. There you go. Put him in there. Throw him to the Sharks. Anyway, so Braun Strowman's doing good in this match and going through you know, it's kinda of back and forth like it like something like this would be like because it, it's two big guys. Yeah. Going back and forth. Exactly and what you would expect from this exactly. match. You got two big guys, two big heavyweight guys. And they're beating each other up. Yep. They're punching each other. They're kicking each other. They're taking, it, throwing each yeah. other around. That's what you would expect from this right here for Intercontinental Championship. Uh, match. Like and subscribe is always um, blessed. Bless you, my child. If you like and subscribe, you could potentially be entering yourself into something. 
potentially down the line. You never know. So, like and subscribe, and we will be back with you soon. Like, just go say some shit. <clears throat> so, we had the Gunther and Braun, and Gunther with the belt. Oh, my belt. God. That was good. Braun had a big spot where he almost won yeah. the match. Yeah. It was a, a good few, match. Yeah. He, like, hit him with the choo-choo train move. Yeah. <laughs> choo-choo train. Around Braun the ring run. Yeah. Boom. He, uh... He power bomb. Close, close line. Close line. Big line. Two counts. Two counts. Braun yep. Strowman. Braun Strowman had a two count. Mm-hmm. He's a two count master. It was close. Um, Luth Gunther. Gunther retained his title. Retained. And so, yeah, that's that. Then we have backstage with Paul Heyman. I love Paul and uh, Sami Zayn. He's just gold. And the bloodline's not there because they're gonna. Let they trust Sammy to take care of Kevin, Kevin Owens. Owens, and I put that in quotation marks. You couldn't see no, it, you didn't. and I don't know if you could hear it in my voice, but yeah. oh boy, they they thought they thought Sammy could handle it on his own. Yeah, that's what's going on here. And then so it's going to be Kevin Owens versus Paul Heyman just thing. gold. I think probably Triple H is like, I don't care what the fuck you say. Just say that Roman and the Bloodline aren't going to be here. Whatever. Yeah. And then and then that's what happened. Paul Heyman Hardy's? just came up with a great. Yeah, that's hard. I'm going Hardy's tomorrow. Four for six. You get four items for six dollars. Nice. I'm doing that tomorrow probably. Anyway, so um, we are sponsored tonight by Hardee's and then Care Centers. Lost Mary Vapes. Lost Mary Vapes and Crowns. And Crush Soda. Crown Cigarettes. Yeah, and Great Value Waters. And Marijuana. And Marijuana. And um, we are brought to you by the um, WFXR Fox. Because we are talking SmackDown right now, like and subscribe, and um, we're about to get into a Kevin Owens match and the backstage stuff. So I think they're kind of being shysty to Sami Zayn, but we will see how this unfolds. And I really like what we just saw with the Gunther and the Braun Strowman. Everything went good with that. I um, suspended my disbelief. Uh, Gunther in this still segment. looks strong. So. I, I suspended my disbelief in the segment with Paul Heyman. Right. And I was, like, thinking that Roman texted Paul, and he's like, look, we can't make it tonight. We're just not coming. Right. You know, whatever. And so Paul was like, well, fuck. What am I going to tell Sammy that the Solo and the Ooses aren't going to be out there to support him? And so Paul was like, I got to come up with some shit. Right. So he went out there and started just bullshitting to Sammy because he is just the master of bullshit. Yeah, that's true. And he, you know, he came up with some shit. And so I suspended my disbelief like that was all real. Yeah. And it was it was golden. Like, that segment was great. I wonder if I can get two fries and two sandwiches for the fourth for, the, uh, fourth for six. But um, that's probably what we're going to go for it. But, um, or we might get one fry, two sandwiches, and a drink. But anyway, let's turn we're back on wrestling now, and it's the Giants versus Viking Sunday, 4 o'clock Eastern. Just like, you know, Rey Mysterio is coming out next, so I'll be back with you with some Rey Mysterio news. Booyaka, booyaka. Okay, so Rey Mysterio, I thought he was going to have a match, but he did not have a match. He came out there in street freaking clothes. He had this really cool shirt on, but the Rey Mysterio shirt. He had a mask on. It was old school looking. He comes out there. He's talking and running his damn mouth. I'm just playing. He's talking and stuff. He's talking and building the feud with talking Dominic. About talking about Dominic, Dominic being an asshole. His son being an asshole on Christmas and all that. Good old jazz. Um, so, and then, he's like, I entered the Royal Rumble, and all that stuff. And he's gonna win it. Yeah, and then he wants to win it. And then, Karrion Cross came out there. Being an asshole. Being an asshole. 
Treat Name Mysterio like shit. Sheesh, I need some pizza. Pizza. He was like being a, a butthole. He was being a butthole. He was talking shit to Rey Mysterio. <laughs> Rey Mysterio was not having it. They weren't having it. Well, Karrion Cross goes and beats the shit out of him. Joked him out. Joked him out the way I wanted him to. Asshole. I told Karrion Cross to Fuck do that. Fuck you, Karrion Cross. I talked to Karrion Cross on the internet. And I told him. You, Karrion Cross. Do that. Strangle the dude. You told him to beat up Raymond Stewart? Yeah. I said, get him. Asshole. Yeah. Um, DoorDash is always available for Verizon customers. If you ever want a DoorDash and you're a Verizon customer, you can do it. Easy. For a limited time, get Everybody can do it. Everybody can do it. No, Verizon only. You'll get a brilliantly made pizza if you use a Verizon phone. Anyway, so we got a beat down of Rey Mysterio, got choked out, can't cross left, and that is about all that has happened so far. So good, so far, so good. Um, SmackDown's pretty lit right now. Um, so. Do you see anything else? Like and subscribe. Uh, so now it's Zion Lee versus Knox. Knox. Tegan Knox. Tegan Knox. Yeah, and has Tegan Knox won yet? I don't know. I can't remember. I think she might have won. She won. Yeah, Tegan Knox won, and that is that match was really good. What I did we it. see after that? Um, a butthole snipper. Oh, the girls. Girls. Blonde girl. Blonde girl. Brown haired girl. Brown haired girl. Blonde girl. And really tall, dark haired girl. Were yelling. Oh, yeah, Rodriguez. And Emma. And. Yeah, they were the all girl, backstage. The yeah. girl, the girl, girl, girl that you like so much that's going to be in Bray Wyatt's thing. Liv Morgan. Yes, Liv Morgan. Yeah. Liv Morgan, that's right. Liv Morgan smacked that big, big girl in the face. Yeah, bam. Rodriguez got it. Or Gonzalez got it. Yeah, it was some balls right there. She so smacked so. her right in the face. Yeah. And she said some shit. And then the other girl said some shit. And they're having a match tonight, I think. Yeah, because matches happen on wrestling. And, um... Matches happen on wrestling. Yeah, matches happen on wrestling. Yeah, insight. <laughs> my insight's impeccable. Uh, <laughs> common sense is on tweet. Oh, man. I right now. Um, we're on Vox. Uh, Roy Rumble coming up soon. In the near future, about we two have weeks a away. prediction video about that. Yeah, it's coming out next weekend, so be looking out for that. Heads. And like and subscribe, and always like and subscribe. Check our videos out. If you don't like and subscribe, only at the thing, um, um, take and um, delete your YouTube account. Comment as well because it helps us get better in the algorithm. Yeah, that is true. We got Bray Wyatt coming out right now, so we will get back to you in a little while. Yeah. Oh, this is dead. Okay, so Bray Wyatt came out there and he gave a one of the greatest promos I've heard him say. It he was beautiful. sitting sitting in his rocking chair, talking like he used to. And it was just amazing. Uh, if you caught it, he said, Uncle Howdy, I am him. So I don't know what's going on with that. But hey, it's a great segment. Uncle Bray Howdy, Wyatt. it was great. It was, I mean, Bray Wyatt, was fabulous. The there was no Uncle Howdy tonight no. so far. Yeah. Bray Wyatt did a great job with that. Great segment for the show. Yeah. Bray Wyatt. That was a great segment. Then we had... Then we had... Sammy. Sammy and KO. 
They did some talking backstage. They were arguing. Sammy was like, do you see what you're making me do? Yeah. And K.O. was like, I'm not putting you in this situation. It was Roman. That did it for you. Made me fight you. I didn't make this match happen. What's going on with that? But this thing I just saw was pretty white. So, great shit. Mm. What is next right now? Coming out like, this is what it is. Liv Morgan. Yeah, we have Liv Morgan Little versus guy. the big, tall, black hair girl. Yeah, Liv Morgan versus Rod, Rod, Raquel, Raquel Rodriguez. Rodriguez. Yeah, Raquel Rodriguez. Yeah. But yeah. We're getting ready to go into that match. This is the format. Yes. And you like and subscribe, right? Right. That's Comment. Good. good. Thank you for liking and subscribing today. Tell us what you like, what you don't like, so we can help. Help me, help me, help you. Help me, help, help, help you. you. Yeah. Help me, help you. Help me, help you. And do your thing when you got Papa John's in your ear. But Liv Morgan's up next. Okay, that match was good between Rocky or whatever. Rodriguez and, um, whatever. So that was a good match and all that. So uh, I guess we'll see what's going on then. Okay, yeah, we had Charlotte Flair and, um, Sonya Deville backstage fighting. We had the Cody Rhodes recovery story being told right now. Um. So, yeah, we're talking about the um, pectoral tear and tearing the bone right out the bone, or the skin out the bone. But uh, we only saw Charlotte and Sonya fighting backstage, and all that. So. Sammy's still got to fight Kevin Owens by himself. So, I hope it's good. Like and subscribe, please. Russell and Matt YouTube channel. We are here for your entertainment. We are here to bring you the news and the predictions and the reviews. Give perspective. All that. And, um, yeah. Like and subscribe, comment, share. Um, you can share to all kinds of platforms and do that. I need some popcorn. I love it. I'm gonna eat Hardy some more, hopefully. Four for six sounds good. Two weeks away, we have Carrying Cross versus Supreme Mysterio on SmackDown. So you can hear the training and moving. And we have in two, you know, next week we have Kevin Owens versus Roman Reigns. Kevin Owens is starting the lane right now. Like and subscribe. It was cool having Joe on. For like the beginning of SmackDown. I got to see something. He had to leave. But anyways, we'll be back with you in a minute. This match between Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn is going really good. Um, he hit him with a brain buster on the side of the ring. So, Sami Zayn's got hold of this match right now. Pretty good match so far. So, hoping for a good match. So, the match between Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn was really good, but, like, next thing you know, Bloodline comes out, and they get, can't, he gets disqualified, and they destroy Kevin Owens, and they put him through a table, they super kick him, they someone spike him, they 3D, they. You know, they do a lot of shit to him. They just destroy Kevin Owens. And they, the Usos are like, we did this for you, Sammy. Zane. This is for you, Sammy. 
I was like, no, I'm supposed to be out here doing my business. I'm supposed to take care of my business because Roman Reigns want me to take care of my business and stuff. So, like, dog, bro, that's just it, man. So, disqualification, the match was shammed. Kind of upset about that, but um, it's all good in the hood. I'm good with that. It's fine. Um, but anyway, I guess that's it. The format is out.